What's up? What's up? Welcome back. I know I've been going for a long, for a good minute now. I just got lazy. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you. I, I stopped making videos. I just had a lot going on in my mind. But I'm back now. We're back and we're better than ever. Happy New Year, everyone. I know, well, it's still early to say that, so it's not late. I will not too late to say that. But yes, Happy New Year. Let's get it. 2021. It's going to be a great year for everybody. All right, today's topic is being an outcast. What is that? Being an outcast is like not fitting in, you know, standing alone and being weird and being different from everybody else and not doing what everybody else does. Because I, for the the majority of my life, felt like an outcast because I never fit in with anything or anybody I remember when I wanted to, like, when I was younger, I wanted to try to fit in. Like, I I tried to do everything everybody else did to be cool, quote-unquote cool, but it didn't ever work. And then I started being myself. Then that actually made me really cool being myself. So one way to be your, to be cool is to be yourself. And don't change for anybody or anything. Because anybody, anything could make you go crazy could hurt you and then make you just forget who you are never forget who you are because you always you always have to be true to yourself a lot of people won't be truthful to you a lot of people are going to turn their turn their back on you and leave you and change on you but you have to stay true to who yourself but yes being an outcast is pretty cool i mean it, it is a lonely road like being an outcast because it's like nobody really understands you but then when you find people that do understand you and they make you feel important, that's that's the dopest feeling in the world. That's doper than any drug could give you, you know? Any feeling that any drug can give you. Because you're just like, damn, man, I'm an outcast. I'm alone. And then people are like, oh, I'm an outcast, too. And they're like, oh, I'm an outcast, too. And it's like, you can all find a common interest, you know? And it, and it gets dope. It's really dope. Um, but yeah, man, like, life has been pretty good for me so far. In my past, it wasn't really all that great. I mean, I I accomplished a lot, and I'm thankful for the things that I've accomplished. But there were, there was a lot of turmoil to get to those points. Because, one, for one, I didn't love myself. I didn't like myself. I didn't care about myself at all. I didn't give a fuck about myself at all all but now that I'm doing this I'm slowly and gradually giving a fuck about myself and caring about myself more and more you know working out every day making sure I'm good making sure the people around me are good and make sure that people around me will always have good energy because I have good energy even on my bad days I try to spread love and positivity you know but yes if you're outcast it's okay you're the best in class. And what class is that? The class of life. Because, like, don't try to fit in with nobody. Fitting in is boring. Doing what everybody else do does is boring as hell, if you want me to be honest. So be you, and whatever you guys want to do, do it. Believe in yourselves, and the world is yours. Like, the sky is the limit. If you believe in yourself, and you just put the work in it, and you put the time and effort into it, bro, you can get anything you want in this world. You can, like, really, it's mind over matter. You can do anything you want in this world. You want to be a billionaire? Just work hard, save your money, you'll be a billionaire. You want to be a game designer, uh, anime creator? Yo, just write some mangas, you know, give it to your friends, and then they'll give it to people, and if people like it, then, hey, you're doing a great job. Don't give up on yourselves. Don't let your demons, your anxieties, and your depression cripple you and crumble you. Because if you let that happen, that is a deep, dark hole you have to dig yourself out of. Yes, some days it may be like, man, I don't want to do shit today. But no, you got to get up, give yourself a pep talk, like, you can do this. You came this far. Can't give up now. So, I just want you guys to always remember... That if you need anything, or you want to just, if you need anything, 
I'm here for you. You can write in the comments, and I'll try to give you the best advice that I can. But I love you guys. You guys are all important. You guys are all rock stars. You guys are all stars. And this world is yours. So take it. Take advantage of everything. Don't have fear. And that's something I'm working on because I, I fear a lot of things. But don't have fear in life. And you can do whatever the fuck you want to do. So if you feel like an outcast, it's okay. We are the best in class because I'm an outcast too. So you can do it. You can do it. You all can do it. I believe in you all. You guys are greater than you guys believe, you know? You guys, your love and support is like, it keeps me motivated. It keeps me going. It keeps me thriving to to better myself and to to make these dope-ass videos. And I like the, I, I see the love and support I'm getting. And it's like, wow. I sh it shocks me every day when I'm like, oh, snap. People are actually really like my videos, you know, like they really enjoy them. And what I'm saying is actually coherent to them and they actually get it and they can apply that to their life or situations in their life. So I love you guys. Today is going to be a double upload day. So after this one, I'll post another one. Um, I love you guys. You can do it. It's mind over matter. Anything is possible. I'm optimistic, so I'm always going to say anything is possible. Because it is. Anything is possible. Um, I love you guys. Stay healthy in mind, body, and soul today. Um, drink your water. Stay hydrated. Meditate. And take care of yourselves. I love you all.